That's what all of us want. All I want. Five, four, three, two. What? (laughs) Yep. We're jumping right into this bitch. Fuck it. No theme song, no nothing. Where's the music? No. We're not getting flagged again. I was about to blast off or something. What? We're not getting flagged again. No music. We got flagged again, people. No more flags. YouTube, I don't like flags. YouTube keeps They're flagging red. us. Fuck that. I don't like in my NFL. Welcome back to the Gentleman's like- Den. Jeff, Frankie, Sean here once again yeah, to God. talk into a microphone for an hour plus and make you guys giggle. I hope. Yeah, well, I mean, hey, first I want to start out with happy birthday to Colin. <laughs> Mardo. Happy birthday. He's uh, oh. one of our our loyalist listeners. Avid listener. So his birthday was this Avid. past week. So The big 24? Dude. Colin, I think, is older than you, Frankie. <laughs> Trying Pretty to make sure he feel is. Good. Two five. Just young pup. Life's just, just starting. Young you got pup when I met him. Yes. We were all young pups. We used to be young. I still am a young pup. I'm forever young. Forever young? Is it forever young or just forever a child? (laughs) Hold on. Let Frankie finish. I mean, I'm just saying, it's a trap. If you don't grow up, then you don't have to. It's a trap. It's a trap. It's a trap. (laughs) What do I, I mean, <laughs> don't let go of your dreams, guys. <laughs> no, you gotta follow. Follow. Follow them. That's the best advice you can get. Is follow. just follow them. Follow like your when dreams. You, if you're down on your luck and you're you're struggling, just remember, just follow. Follow your There's dreams. There's a path for you. This and it'll podcast, lead you to where you need to be. This podcast was my dream. And look at me. I'm living it. You're living <laughs> your dream. I'm so proud of you. It wasn't to have kids and be a good father. Nah, it was just and, him. you know, provide for my family. I was, I want to talk about penis size on video games with my friends. <laughs> that was it. And We're last talking week, about you guys important made things. it possible. Thank you. <laughs> did you guys did you guys get your money back for that broken game? No, I'm so hooked on this story. Yeah, I'm yeah. so torn. I just want to you know. know we talked it about it a little bit last week, and we kind of dove into it, but then I played it again mm-hmm. this week. Not and now I, I don't know. More high. I love the story and I love the visuals, but. It just glitches too much. Talking about Cyberpunk, by the way. Yeah. Again. Sean, you've been playing it more, right? Or did you no, leave it alone? I, since I really haven't since last week. I Like I said, I've been so goddamn busy with work that I, uh, yeah, I played like two games of Madden this week. That's it. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, I, guys are on I, hopped on, I hopped on Madden because I... You know the month they give you the uh, monthly uh, packs, Madden packs. Yeah. So I went out and opened up a bunch of packs, and then I'm like, okay, I'll play a couple of games of my mm-hmm. franchise, and then I was like, all right, I'm over it. I'll play Cyberpunk Done. for a little bit. Played Cyber Cyberpunk for like a half hour on Friday, and I'm just like, all right, I'm going to bed. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so torn because I love. The story and I love the visuals, the futuristic city, but it is just so glitchy and so shitty. Like it's supposed yeah. to be this packed city <laughs> and there's like nobody around. There's no I'm looking for a car to steal because I gotta yeah, get to never this a car. And I'm not walking three hundred uh, yeah. kilometers on foot. Can your guy run? How long does that take? Yeah, he can run. My guy doesn't run. You know why he can't run? I found this out today because my guy stopped running. Your inventory is full. You have too many guns and too much shit, so you can't run fast. You have to go to, like, a deposit. You have to go to a deposit and sell. 
you can sell your guns. I did and I have, that and I still did, can't uh, run. No. Twins teach you. Hold on, my daughter's here. <laughs> Love you, pal. Good night. <laughs> So this is our uh, pre-Christmas podcast. Can't believe it's going to be Christmas. Yeah. Uh, if you buy, if you said post-Christmas, I'd be like, holy fuck, that time travel? <laughs> I missed it? <laughs> no. Shit. For, this, is, this will come out uh, well, later today for us, but Sunday morning. Tomorrow. I'll actually probably post it. It'll be posted right after we get done talking about it, which is awesome with this technology. But <sighs> technology nowadays, guys. I mean, I remember where I had to put a CD player portable with a tape deck to listen to my music. <laughs> Motherfuckers, Bluetooth and shit now. Like it's. It's in Stuff's the fucking in the cloud. waves. Stuff's up in the yeah, clouds. Yeah, it's clouds. I fucking, still have. We didn't have clouds like that in my day. I still have the cassette adapter with the with the cord that came out. Right, that's what he's talking about. Yeah, I still have that. <laughs> Are you listening to what I'm saying? I still have one of those. <laughs> Do you remember that anti-skip button that never <laughs> works? Never. Anti-skip my ass, dude. That thing. Well, if you shake a CD, it's going to fucking skip. Yeah. There's no yeah. getting around it. What is the nope. what does the anti shake button do? I want to Google this. The anti I mean, skip button makes that laser read. Did it like so much pour better. like that demolition man <laughs> foam? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and like Pat this is foam just CD. saved my life. So <laughs> shake. <laughs> so you ought to hear something crazy. Like I was, you know, shit and scroll scrolling through facebook and an ad for ebay came up and i was just scrolling through what they were selling someone had a walkman in the box still they were selling that bitch for like nine hundred dollars fuck yeah they were collector's item dude you know what's crazy i was listening i think it was joe rogan they were talking about this but that flappy bird game you can't get anymore what game? What, Flappy Bird. Oh, okay. Do you remember you had to fly? Do you guys don't remember Flappy Bird? Oh, where you had to Do you remember that helicopter screen? game on yeah. E-Bombs World, Frankie? It was like that. Mm-hmm. It had a bird, and it had to fly through, like, Super Mario tubes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. And then it was super hard. But, okay, so the guy canceled the game. You can't download it anymore. But there's phones that still have it on, like old phones, mm-hmm. and they're selling on eBay for over $1,000. <laughs> Oh my god. So what you're telling me is just what so they is can play a fucking people? flappy bird. So what you're telling me is to download a bunch of bullshit games on my phone so when my phone goes obsolete and the games are fucking no longer available. Yes, yeah. keep those games. Keep those apps. Unreal. Keep bullshit. It's crazy. I mean, I guess you think about that and you're like, that's fucking nuts that someone would pay for it. But then again you look at like these fucking antique people that have like a sign and you're like, Oh, that rusted sign that has some oil company on it. I'd give you a fucking 20 bucks for it. And you're like, that sign that's $2,800. You're like, what? he has been watching American pickers. Yeah. I love it. History channel is my shit. Yet you don't so retain knowledge, any man. <laughs> I mean, I could tell you all about, Curse of Oak Island. <laughs> what? Nothing, bro. I love you. I didn't get to hear you. you, you I, I just wanted to hear what you said. You cut out. Yeah, you. Your internet shit on you. That's fine. Just keep it rolling. Great job, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, see, when you put so your Sean, dream you and your hard about- work into this. Yeah, this is. I told you this is my dream. So, follow him. Follow. He'll be coming. That's our new shirt. Follow your dreams. I think it's it, already a shirt. If you follow it, it will come. <laughs> Mostly on your back or in your hair. <laughs> I don't think that that's how it works either. What? 
if you follow it, it will come. <laughs> All over your back or in or your hair. Coom. Coom. <laughs> I don't know about the spelling. Comb. <laughs> so what were you saying, Jeff, now? Oh, you were talking. You were talking earlier about. I mean, we were talking about like feeling old and all this shit, and the kids react. Yeah. To what, what band was it again? The Beastie Boys. Like the Beastie fucking boys. Like, and it's and it's not kids. It's like legitimate, like twenty four to twenty five year old dudes. There's like I've never That's heard. Even worse. I'm like, where the f- what the fuck are you talking? Where are your parents at? That like yeah, they didn't have good role models. No. Uh, you've, no Beastie Boys? Well, Forget think about, about it. it. And, and then I sat down and may have been traveling through space and time. <laughs> you might be tonight. I, I tried joining you. Frankie's, he hasn't moved in 10 minutes. I don't know. <laughs> Frankie's, the, right. either his phone froze or the pause button hit on his screen. <laughs> Oh, but, there he is. Yeah. Beautiful smile. But it's it's like uh you know when you hear a new song and you get that feeling. You know that Yeah, right. Like, oh this is a jam. <laughs> this song is fucking dope. Like can you imagine hearing Beastie Boys for the first time? Or hearing Big for the first time, or hearing Pac for the first time? I feel like right. it depends though, like on how someone hyped it. Someone like hide me on like the Beastie Boys, and they're like, "Oh, dude, the Beastie no, no, Boys no. are so dope for this and that." And then you hear it, maybe your expectations aren't there for. No, you're probably waiting what for I'm, some mumble rap. What I'm talking about is, no one tells you about it. It's like you just find it. Find it. Yeah, when you yeah, if you were to discover Pac and like Biggie and like you're going through YouTube and you're like, "Oh, '90s hip hop. Let's look at this." Right, and then you're like, holy shit. But that's kind of how it is when I had, like, the classic rock, you know? Like, I wasn't around in the 70s. Yeah. But, you know, when you hear that shit, you're just like, oh, what the fuck? You know, like, the first time you heard Stairway to Heaven or, well, yeah, know, but Voodoo Child by fucking Jimi Hendrix, like, holy fuck. I just think it's different now because of... Like, when we were growing up, the radio was always on at my house, basically. Yeah. You know what I mean? Or MTV. Yeah. It was always on. There was always some kind of music. So you always, I always knew about, you know, like, I can, I can't remember a time when I didn't know who Steve Miller band was or Kiss or, you know, any of those bands. Right. Right. But see, like, there's still people, like, I mean, I'll respect stuff like that, but, like, I probably couldn't name one Kiss song. I guarantee Just you n- can name one Kiss song. Yeah, it was a I, movie. I literally was just trying to think of it, and I couldn't. That's why I said it. I I mean, <laughs> I yeah, I can't, I can't think of Rock one and roll all night and party name. every day. Some of the day. Um, Part of the day. Part of the day. <laughs> I, 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 don't, I don't like to party. Party too. part of the day. <laughs> I, I can't rock and roll too long, dude. One of your one of your favorite movies was Detroit, Detroit rock, rock City, City. I, you can't even name a Kiss song. You should be slapped in the face. The I'm name, just saying, bro. The name of the movie is even... a Kiss song. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I don't. I don't care to to look into stuff like that. I'm just saying though, like I'm not Even like the from biggest movies, Kiss fan. Like you, you've seen role models, right? And he's talking about Kiss. The song's called Love Gun. He's talking about his penis. Yeah, yeah. Right. I'm just saying. Uh, right there, my, you could have just my, said Love Gun. I don't you've think never it, even heard. The but song I don't before. think of that. That's what I'm saying. I'm not like if you were to say something about a different. Someone that I'm more relevant with. I'm not saying that they're Let's not talk good. Talk about it's just not little my Wayne mixtapes taste. for a while. It, right, I could probably tell you some songs by him. DJ White Owl. Who? <laughs> Damn son, where'd you find this? No, Frankie it, was the mixtape master. I mean, your computer 
Is I never there? downloaded any music illegally ever in my life. Let's just get that. No, out this straight. is when this is when you lived in Mexico and you downloaded all that music and then brought your hard drive back. <laughs> it sounds even worse. Like now I'm bringing the smuggler music over <laughs> across the <state> lines. <laughs> <laughs> this fucking shit's been imported, Holmes. Dude. Well, what's funny is, Sean, you're talking about like people, music, and like feeling old. Yeah. Someone posted, "You're this old." And it was a LimeWire thing. And then I'm just thinking to myself, I'm even older. I was around with Napster. <laughs> right, when that shit started. Yo, we're older than that. We're cassette tape record on right. the radio. <laughs> oh, man, I made so many of my mixes. Yeah, Stay up for the late line. night DJs. Yeah, the guys 10. that didn't talk. Yeah, I, I don't. As long as he was mixing music with turntables, you get a couple, little bit of scratching in there. You're like, oh shit! B ninety six, killing it. B ninety six. Anything in the worse mix. as a child is when you've been waiting all day for a song to play so you can record it, and then you're doing something, and then you hear the song. You're shit. Now you got to wait another I've twelve hours, twenty seconds. Is <laughs> See, <laughs> not even on there. See, nowadays all you have to do is wait three songs, and that song's coming right back on. Yeah, and every uh, hour they just been so like, replayed. Did. Like actually, K- back in the day, radio shows they talked like, and played music. Kiss FM is to be a DJ on Kiss FM. You just have to be breathing. Is basically <laughs> what it is. I'm breathing. Because they give you a percent, dude. It's the same. They they go, here's your eight songs, hit play, and don't forget to turn the loop on. And then next hour, I want them in a different order. No, they don't even change change the order. order. (laughs) It's a solid top eight. It is weird. Do you guys ever notice, like, so if you haven't heard a song in a long time? And, I mean, I don't really listen. This used to happen to me when I listened to the fuck radio. But you haven't heard, like, a song in forever. It's, like, ten years later, you'll hear, like, Jay-Z, you know. Fucking, uh, God, I can't remember that one song. The one from Rush Hour. <laughs> the one with Ja Rule. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, it was a Ja Rule song, and Jay-Z just happened to be on it. With Jay-Z no, and a I million. No, Jay-Z song. How did it go? I can't remember. Yeah, I, I can't think of it off the top of my head, but it, it was Jay Z. Really, no, it's not what they really want from a. No. That's a. <laughs> what is it? Oh, that was Cisco. Oh, oh. <laughs> yeah, that was Cisco. No. That was like, what? what? Can I, I get what? a what? What? That one. Yeah. Can I get a fuck you? Yeah. That's his fucking song. Can I hit it in the morning? Oh, my daughter's back. Thank you, Bob. That Jay Z spitting. Yeah. Junkers. All right, love you, daughter. God, fucking savage. Not nice, daughter. Run along, little the child. What are we talking about? Oh yeah, so you'd hear like the Jay Z song on one radio station. You haven't heard it in ten fucking years, and then you'll hear it like on the other radio station, like not too much longer. Like, do they have spies? They're like, hey, they're playing this over there on Kiss FM. No, it's because oh, they're, it's cause they're all part of too. they're all part of one radio conglomerate. There's uh, only one guy that's ruling all the radio. I Heart Radio. Basically, yeah, I Heart Radio bought you out all You play what I you say. You me running the fucker B96. I Heart well, Radio bought out all the radio stations. There's really not all of them. There's really not too many independent radio stations running anymore. Everybody is an iHeart radio station. We should start a radio station, and then yeah, well, iHeart I radio can buy, buy us out, right? And then I'll just be like ten million, give you a good deal. Because we would lose all of our uh, sponsors, all of, all of our field, <laughs> yeah, if we were millionaires. We're broke ass, fucking blue collar assholes that just have a dream of fucking making people giggle on their way to work. 
to a job. Oh, they, I'm a great tickler. To, to a job they, to a job they hate where they don't get any fucking recognition for the hours and hours no of work respect. they put in. I would love if someone gave me a bunch of money because I'd give a bunch of other people a bunch of money. Just saying. Hey, do you want to win some money? Ooh, how? Tell me. I'll tell you how. Every time. <laughs> tell so me. When you're going over to someone's house and be like, hey, I bet you 20 bucks if you turn MTV on, ridiculousness is on. <laughs> and you'll win every fucking time. <laughs> you can do the same one. still had MTV. And then you can go, you want to go double or nothing? I bet if you turn on Comedy Central, South Park's on. <laughs> Does that really work? Dude, every time, every time fucking MTV's on, it's ridiculousness. It's ridiculousness and in Comedy Central South Park. I'm I just saying those are two good shows. They just know that they got a good thing going and why fuck it up. No, it's there's no thought in TV. It's easy programming. It's How about program. the goddamn music thing? Dude. Yeah, isn't that what music television? Is that what it is? Watch MTV. I, don't know. I, I never thought I would say it, but idiocracy is becoming more and more of a fucking learning tool than it is a comedic what? movie. Because <laughs> yeah. it's what we're headed to. Not oh, sure. Yes. That? We're going to have to... Is ridiculousness on? For Sean, check. You got three TVs going. <laughs> yeah, all right. Tired about being broke. This but guy's got close, fucking nine it. TVs. I've a got... Whole compound. I've got two TVs, and I've got the one is free that's on my wall, and the the one that I have you guys on is ninety nine bucks from fucking Walmart. Can you turn MTV on quick? I'm actually gonna use the app on my phone. You got the you MTV, MTV app? app? <laughs> no, the spec the the charter app, the Spectrum app. See who's winning the the Road Rules Challenge? Is that even on anymore? So we're going. I think, to, I think I saw it on Netflix. Not gonna lie, it's on something. The other, yeah. Oh, it was that. I was gonna say. I was like, "What was that one where they're like competing and they're all over the world?" That's the Amazing Race. Oh, I thought that was Road World. <laughs> <laughs> that not no, it? bro. No, I mean you're close. Were, were they on roads? Road? Oh, uh, ridiculousness is on. Uh, for the next, uh, is it on? Yeah, told pay you. Me money. Pay me, and I'm I'm legitimately scrolling. It goes from Sunday at uh, noon. <laughs> it goes from like, re- what the fuck? It goes from ridiculousness to deliciousness, which Ooh, I have no that? idea what the Yummy. fuck that is. And then that's on for 12 hours. <laughs> and it goes we back to ridiculousness. Sure a good taste. It goes back to ridiculousness. <laughs> There's no other programming on MTV but ridiculousness. Why? It's always on, dude. So I just you know what I would call that? Your that's your ridiculous. House. Go over to your friend's house and be like, dude, I bet you 20 bucks ridiculousness is on. Boom. Oh. Fuck you, pay uh, me. Call me tomorrow and bet me. So <laughs> anytime afternoon I'll be up. <laughs> I'm, you know, I'm looking at the guide right now, and VH1's right underneath it. And VH1 is playing. They're playing it too. No, no, no. VH1 is all the TV shows we grew up with, like Martin and Living Single, and oh man, yeah. So Living it's... Single, which one? Oh uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> VH1, okay, VH1 has become BET Lite. Because it's... it's BET Lite? It's leg- I don't know what that means. <laughs> it's legitimately... Everything that BET played 10 years what ago. What they mix in Brett Michaels, Rock of Love. <laughs> no, they don't even yeah, do that it, anymore. It, it, you got to mix in like a tool time Those or something. VH1. I used to love watching VH1 because they had the I love like the 80s. Yep. And pop up video. I love the 90s. Yeah. 
They ain't got that shit I was either. I for that. VH1 Maybe you guys Vision. can get those on DVD. Get that on Beta Vision. Maybe I'll get the whole set, whole, all seasons of Martin. Yeah. It's comical what passes for TV now. If it's not a reality-based show, no one watches it. No. I feel like no. whatever's on TV is what's TV. Sure. That's deep, bro. <laughs> That's real deep. I'm glad you shared just that with let us. It, <laughs> let it sit in. Just let it sit in. I, I, I wish I had the everyone is now dumber in the room. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> You just said that it's crazy the things that are on TV. I said, yeah, I, I think whatever's on TV is what's it's on TV. It's not like literally on my TV. It's like inside it. Like it's a puppet. Where? Show. My TV's really thin. There's, there can't be that much stuff inside it. Yeah. No, but the you got two TVs. In the back. The computer. You, you got two back TVs. Back in the day, we used to have a big old box. That's that why you should turn your TV off for a little bit. Those people inside need a rest. Oh, no, I work them like dogs. Entertain me. Cheers, boys. That's what they're in there for. It's got a drink. Oh. Yeah, I got a drink. Dude, I drink so much water, it's disgusting. Where's the intensifier? <laughs> I didn't buy any orange juice. I bummed it myself. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot. What, that orange juice and mushrooms don't go together? No, I forgot to buy orange juice. I was at, <laughs> I was at the store today. I just, well, how are you feeling right now? Fine. Fine? Fine. Wonderful. I feel fine. I didn't, there's no mushroom trolls running around? No, I have a very nice body buzz. Awesome. Yeah. Other than that, my I was going to make a stiff ass fucking drink. And then as soon as I opened the ice chest, I was like, I took an edible. <laughs> Probably pumped the brakes because uh, it's going to be kicking in shortly here. <laughs> oh, man. I, uh, I keep, I, you know, we still got to get, what, 38 more episodes done. <laughs> oh, no. To episode 100. For the I can't, bro. The hundred no milligrams. Frankie had way. like fifty milligrams, and as soon as he jumped out of that plane, we all know how it ended. No, oh, we're going a hundred milligrams. No way, dude. We're gonna take it at the beginning of the show, <laughs> so we're, we'll see the gradual death of us. We'll we'll fucking record an hour, stop it, and then start sixty minutes new- later. I'm going to sleep. Back he might be because sick I don't want to be a yeah I don't want to be awake for what I'm gonna have to go through for the next four hours after that. <sighs> Buckle up, just ride that roller Buckle coaster. Up. I don't want to ride it anymore. Uh, this is some titillating fucking <laughs> conversations we're having for these fucking people that are listening. Hey guys, let me tell you. Hey, well, while we're bringing the mood down, let me tell you about my awesome parenting. Make sure there's no kids around here. So this is how it goes. So I moved recently, and uh, we were taking the kids' uh, beds apart to uh, put them in storage, and you know some stuff in storage, some stuff not. Oh, my daughter's up. Can't tell a story. It's a- oh, <laughs> no, but the tease. Don't the worry. Tease. Your, your, your internet. Bed. Your internet censored you real quick. Yeah, I didn't hear what you said. Awesome no. parenting skills. Awesome parenting. Get to sleep, child. Well, uh, Fucking it's three bedtime. in the morning. What time is it? I have no clue. It is bedtime. I love you. Go bed. Oh, uh, no. 12.37. Bella, it's bedtime. I love you, daughter. Hey, Jeff. Go you'll, ahead, be, you'll be proud of me. I uh, finally bought a weighted blanket. Oh. Why is it not on? It should be on at all times. 
I haven't even pulled it out of oh, the box yet. I love it. Because I, got, I can't do it. I got I've had horrible one. dreams. I felt like I was being held down. I bought didn't my, like it. So that's why I bought my ma for Christmas. So when she gets hers, I'll grab mine. I don't know what she's Yeah. Doing. Weird. I'm weird like that. What do you mean? So you can't have yours until she has hers? No. Basically, yeah. Because you don't want to so, be show yes. Yeah, I don't. Look at what I have. Exactly. Because I literally just went on Amazon and went quantity two and bought the same fucking thing. Oh, um, nice. So the box comes, there's this a yellow or an orange sticker on the side of it that just says heavy. And I watched this <laughs> this 130 pound <laughs> delivery boy try to carry this box. <laughs> this 30 pound box because they're 215, they're 15 pound weighted blankets. This, Jesus. I watched this dude fucking struggle carry this box. Holy fuck. Yeah, son of a bitch. You know, the just, fuck's in here? Wait. No, those are my blankets. Those are blankets, son. Not a fan. Yeah, I, I mean, mean, a quick, I had workout, horrible I mean a quick workout. You just do some blanket curls. Yeah. Oh, it's... I laughed. I picked up the box today just to get it out of the way. I was like, Jesus Christ, what's in here? I'm like, oh, yeah. Lead. Lead. I don't know. Pretty sure it's glass. You haven't even laid with it. How dare you? Not yet. I even bring it up. Dude, I'm denying myself the pleasure until I, uh, <laughs> until Christmas. <laughs> I bought myself a Christmas pleasure present. Frankie, Frankie. Bought one. I don't think he, he don't like it. He feels smothered. Can't breathe. Frank Frankie buys shit like impulse buys shit that he like, he keeps. He keeps. Well, it wasn't. I wasn't like I need to buy this. Jeff was like, you need to buy one, and I was like, all right. Yeah, I'll we have a one. whole podcast named "Weighted Blankets Are the Shit." Yeah. See. <laughs> And I just, uh, I don't know. I had well, nightmares okay. and shit when I was sleeping with it. Nightmares? To I just have nightmares when I didn't use it. I don't, I don't know. Really? Maybe Feel it's restricted. Curtis. Maybe it should be on like an episode of Unsolved Mysteries. <laughs> Meet Francis. <laughs> Likes to cross his arms and looks up. Looks like He's been now. haunted for years by a weighted blanket. <laughs> but one night he threw that weighted blanket out and his dream went from nightmares to good lollipops in so so if if Jeff tells you you need to buy this you go out and buy it um I value his opinion All right, and Jeff, I bro, I was pretty time out I'll give I was, it a try I was convincing as fuck okay I was Jeff, convincing him. Convince him then to buy a fucking computer so we can fucking start putting shit on uh, Yeah, we're working on it. Yeah. I've already said just tell me what uh, what kind and I'll add the cart. I just need to know. I'm I'm not sure. I'm not up on it. I don't want to get the wrong one like I did already. What do you mean like you did already? I got that other laptop you're like that, you can't use that. So I got rid of it. That wasn't a laptop, dude. That was like a Surface it Pro. It opened up, so I was like, fuck, all right. That was a Surface. It was a tablet. Lap. It opens up. Like a clam, bro. Dude, it was a tablet. <laughs> you basically bought an iPad with a fucking keyboard. John Walker, yeah, Frankie, Frankie walks in the store. He's like, I'm looking for one of these. <laughs> you guys got any of these? What are these slam hands? You got any of these the, uh... slam hands? <laughs> Just buy what like, Jeff has. Oh, you... Buy what I got, bro. Simple Is as that. that. Video so I need that. All right, take a picture of it. Send it. Okay, I'll send it. I'm gonna Google it right now. I'm set a reminder. Set Call reminder. Frankie tomorrow. Tell him he's gay. <laughs> and tell him about like you. Do that every day. I got a whole bunch of messages, like 96 of them, of you telling me how gay I am. Jesus Christ. I don't think we I feel like that's an ongoing thing, though. Because <laughs> for the last 10 sensitive. years, every time 
one of us don't answer the phone, we just leave a message telling the other person how gay they are. Probably on top of rainbow. Well, dick up a unicorn's ass. Let's do real gay stuff right now. Let's be honest. The only one that doesn't answer the phone calls is you, Frankie. What do you mean? It's because if I don't answer, it's because I'm sleeping. I know your schedule. I don't know what time to call you. Yeah, it's off at like four today, o'clock. I, woke, on, I went to bed last night at seven. I go into Chili's. I got queso dip was horrible. I got some fucking buffalo wings and uh, classic nachos. I ate by about six thirty, seven o'clock. I went upstairs, passed the fuck out. Woke up at three in the morning, and I've been up ever since. So I'm almost on twenty four hours right now. Damn. I'm gonna sleep good. I'm gonna sleep right up to the fucking noon games tomorrow. Perfect. Cause fuck it, it's America. All right, my kids are sleeping. You want me to pay this off or what? Yeah, I'm dying. Please. Been Horrible blue balling us long enough. I hope it's worth it. I hope it was worth the wait, guys. <laughs> been blue balling us long enough, bud. I I felt like a horrible parent, and so did my lady. So we're packing <clears> up their bed, <throat> getting ready for the move, and we're moving their pillows. One of them has, like, two teeth. <laughs> what? Bags behind their pillows. <laughs> no <laughs> fucking way. No money was left. Dude, that these dude's kids, better be coming back dropping Benjamins. These Yo. kids were Co- probably checking their pillow every night. What, what the fuck? This dude ain't come again? COVID hit. What the fuck is COVID hit hard. Fucker. Even the tooth fairy ain't making it. Bro, there's there's two what teeth and bags do? under one of theirs. And then, I'm going to ask him. I'm be like, were you guys always staying up waiting for the tooth fairy trying to catch him and rob him? Because if oh he knows you're God. staying up, he ain't going to come. He knows not to come and get robbed. That man comes with loot. It was one of the lowest moments of my life. <laughs> I was like, I failed. I failed him. <laughs> oh, my God. That's awesome. All right, hold on, though. I need to know. Were these just, like, little badasses that went and put them in bags and put them under there themselves when the tooth came out? Or did they, like, tell you, I lost the tooth? And you're like, yeah, put it under no, your just, pillow. Well, you, do, you don't want to just put a random tooth under the pillow. So they are like, I lost the tooth. You're like, oh, sweet. The tooth fairy will come tonight. And then you put it in a bag. That bitch never shows up. Sandwich bag under the pillow because it's easier to find, you know, than a tooth. So you just grab the sandwich bag. Got it. I get that part. <laughs> I'm saying, though, did they just put them in sandwich bags and put them under there? Or did they tell you, hey, I lost the No, tooth. no, they told us every time. Because, you know, when they get excited so about you, it. You just forgot? Yeah, I just forgot. <laughs> oh, that's bad. Oh, you better shit. be getting some Benjamin Franklins out and being like, ah, that, that dude must have been waiting for COVID to leave. I All don't right. know. Well, he made up for it. Yeah, he, he definitely did. made up for it. Look at Sean like, Stark. Find so many games. Oh, I think he can God. hear it. <laughs> Bro, your dog is like laying there. Spread eagle. Yeah, I know. It's like a, you know it's YouTube to be an E-rated it. show, all right? Yeah, I'm going to have to blur that out when I edit the video. <laughs> Everybody wants to see my dog's... Fucking dong. Tell them, bastard, keep this shit PG-13, all right? Sorry, man. I drink fucking a gallon and a half of water today. I'm fucking leaking. Failed, <laughs> That's guys. a problem. Failed as a parent. Go talk to your Sean doctor. Sean as an old man. It's bladder. failing him. Dude, I drink more water <laughs> than anybody fucking should. I really do. Well, don't drown yourself. Now yeah. I'm concerned. No, it's not good that. You're a good swimmer. I mean, you're drinking I, gallons of water. You, you, there's a lady that died. All right. What are you talking about? There you was can a, die. There there's was a, a water contest. Truck. You're, you're supposed the to radio. drink at least. You're supposed to drink at least a gallon of water a day, boys. Not that fast, though. 
Right, you're over here, Mr. Chugging stuff. Dude, there's barely anything out of this. Frank, you explain this story. There was a lady that was on a contest on a radio station, and it was they drink a gallon of water, and then the if you go pee, well, there was you a lose. bunch of contestants. Let's just right. say that there was a bunch of contestants, and they were racing, and she was one of the contestants. Was it like a last she person drank, standing contest? Kind yeah, of, yeah. Whoever to, doesn't pee, then, yes, wins. And people are going pee, going pee, and she kept holding it. She had so much water in her body, she fucking drowned, 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 drowned. She drowned, drowned, drowned. drowned. What's crazy is like the DJs that were like not working for the radio show announcing it. Mm -hmm. They were like, "Can you die from this?" Like, I don't know, and they're like laughing about right. it. Well, she so did. That was like one of the big fucking things. But yeah, so if you chug water too fast, you will die. I don't chug water. Yep. Merry mean, Christmas, guys. Oh, yeah. This is the learning the, channel. The darkest fucking podcast we could put out. So, what other fucking radio station fucking idiots have died putting their hand on a car for 37 hours? So many. So many. Oh, I don't understand people. that at all. I think, uh, well, we watch those YouTube videos. I would just tape my hand to it. It's not coming on. off. It it's coming not coming off. off. It's duct taped, this motherfucker. Do I win? Yeah. I think that's cheating, though. That's like stick them in yeah, football. It's not, <laughs> yeah, it's like, that's, that's like a performance-enhancing drug. Right, yeah. Uh, you can't just be doing cocaine off the fucking rear view mirror and duct tape your hand to yeah. the top. I, I, I didn't see it in the rule book, so. Coach, you know this don't look natural. By, it looks like I jerked off an elephant. By any genes necessary, as Kanye would say. Ooh. What does that mean? Instead of by any means What's necessary. What does that mean? Yeah, day. jeans, like your jeans, like your DNA, or like your pants. Pants. Hmm. He is a fashion he was aficionado. Good? Jesus, quack like a duck over there. Quack your duck? Is it rubber? <laughs> <laughs> Rubber ducky. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I'm high. <laughs> Is that edible finally kicking in? No, it's been done kicked in. Big done and had in there. Face. <sighs> Is everyone feeling like a 10 tonight? I'm feeling like uh, we're going to get done with this podcast, and I'm going to go put that ASMR on. Mm-hmm. Oh Maybe some my little, God. some hot girl, big breasts is gonna snap her fingers and whisper into my ear. And then they scratch right. oh. Don't do that! Don't do that! Our <laughs> listeners, oh <laughs> no! Sorry. Okay. Fucking weird dudes got their fingers right, all in their like, ears. Stop touching me. Yeah, we're definitely never going to be in a Those somebody. videos don't make me relax because half the chicks got fucking, they're popping out their turtleneck. Yeah. They're telling me about how I need to, ah, everybody come up now. Well, you're not supposed and to be I'm watching the video. You're supposed to. Eyes closed, headphones on. Yeah, you're yeah. supposed to go. Okay, and not. They made it visually very pleasant to the eyes. Then it should just be their voice. And it right. The but video, no. but people aren't watching those. I watch or anything them. else. Oh, you do? You watch them or you listen to them? There's a difference between hearing and listening to Jimmy. I watch them. <laughs> Like I have a I listen while watching, but I'm supposed to be just listening. Like I have a guided it's meditation on my phone. You have like what? What do you have, Sean? It's called a guided. It's guided meditation. It's basically 
<laughs> it's basically meditating. <laughs> but they, you know, talk you through the, you know, take five deep breaths in, five deep breaths, you know, five Man. seconds in, five seconds out, relax. Bro, hey. You guys I use a different method, five seconds in, five seconds out. It's good. Out. You were training to take those mushrooms. <laughs> For sure. But ah, I throw my head. Download this app, mushroomhelp.com. Like, <laughs> when, I, when I wasn't. The mushroom meditation. When I, in the middle of that three-year run, I needed something to de-stress. <sighs> And that's what I use was like a guy. And they're called ASMR. Well, no, ASMR. it's not even ASMR. It's it's basically <laughs> weird ass music. Is it is it Headspace? Yeah, it's like Headspace. What's it called? Calm. Is Headspace and Calm's like the big one? Yeah, it, but I don't even this know was what the fuck you guys like talking about. Is this like a, God's like talking God. to you while you're sleeping no, or no, what? No, it's a meditation app. It's, I tried Headspace. Yeah, it's space. It's basically Headspace. Is what but I just got the free one. Yeah, so I couldn't unlock my full potential of no. relaxation. <laughs> no, but it's. Hey, if you want to really fucking relax, it's gonna cost you, motherfucker. Every time I do that, ninety nine a month. <laughs> every time I do that half hour guided meditation, I would f- wake up. Like from the best Cover. nap I've ever had. Cover. Really? No, honestly, I'd wake Did up. Did it and, help you though? For real? Yeah, it, it's the it sets your brain just to stupid. <laughs> it shuts everything. My brain's down. already there, bro. I no, don't I mean, no help. But, <laughs> I'm set to stupid. No, your I'm good. Your brain goes like a fucking hamster on a wheel, just fucking going and going and going. That's why I watch the same movie every night to fall asleep. Well, that's the same thing as using a guided meditation. That's your meditation. What did you just say? A guy did what? Guided meditation. It's not like you sitting by yourself meditating because you See, could. I feel like I, honestly, that'd be I a can't good name do it. for a show. Frank, you've never tried it. I mean, I think it's worth a try. I've done it. It's no pretty way. fucking. It's pretty relaxing. When you have a good I guide, want, I couldn't even sleep with these in, in my ears. They're like I laying, would fucking... No, no, no. I'm not talking about going to bed. That's that was something else we talked about. Now we're talking about guided meditation. We were talking about ASMR. I want to know what to guy did meditation. 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 <laughs> that medication. Yeah. A guided medication is your drug dealer. Yeah, right? <laughs> that's guiding, guy? guiding drugs into your face. A guy. <laughs> He's guiding you through your medicine. <laughs> a guy did meditation. Yeah. It's it's basically I know. So it's basically <laughs> you just follow you follow what he's saying. You follow what the person's saying. But I know you guys aren't following what I'm saying. You and guys are always talking about English guided. Place. Guided. Frankie, what you like to do in right now? But you wait, you keep saying it is wait, a guy. You've got to be quiet. You've got to be quiet. I close your eyes. I can't shut up. Put your hands to your heart. Feel it beating. Breathe in. No, that would get me fucked up. I you feel can't like, even, am I breathing? You can't even do well, well, I have fucking a heart minute meditation without talking. This is... This is why Frankie will forever be a kid because he can't shut his fucking. He, he's, he can't his, relax. His I anxiety, you, bro. Is, I can. You you are you the most told anxious me I was a person statue. without having anxiety. I have anxiety. Who doesn't? I am a human. Like we all, we always make fun of Man, of Manus when he's DJing and he gets all twitchy. Yeah, the the Manus twitch. You know who else has anxiety? Papa Roach and the Black Eyed Peas. <laughs> you son of a bitch. <laughs> oh, my God. It's sane and the insane but rivalry. Med- meditation. <laughs> I always dance in the rain to that song. Every time it's raining, I just put that song on and go outside and 
dance angrily. Frank, like, you're all my frustration. Like they said in basketball, your attention span can be measured in nanoseconds. Nanoseconds. Huh? What did you say? Exactly. What? <laughs> <laughs> you guys didn't get the concept right of what I was saying. You kept saying a guided medication or meditation. And I was saying guided meditation. And you're like, yeah, a guided meditation. No, we said guided, not like a person did yeah, meditation. I, I, a guy <laughs> did meditation. <laughs> One guy, one guy. Yeah, his name was Buddha. Meditation. (laughs) A guy did. A guy did meditation. Yo, this has been like a 10 minute running joke. It's. it's, Yeah, let's go. We beat the horse to fucking death. I even tried to fucking. Did you get it? I tried tried to guide you. You didn't want to guide it. I don't want you behind me. You know who Frankie would be in that. It, in that meditation thing, remember the movie Accepted, the blonde-haired dude that was fucking all over the place? Yeah. That's Frankie's brain. Yeah, no, I don't know. What is I it? I like turtles. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> now he's got nothing. Exactly. I'm trying to think of the movie. Accepted. Guided meditation, bro. With <laughs> accepted, where they fucking start their own school. South Harmon Institute of Technology. The shit, shit sandwiches. Yeah, I'm trying to think of it. I can think of the movie, what you're saying. I, that I, I remembered. I can't think of the movie, period. I can't think of who's in it. I Justin can't think Long. of the characters. Who? Well, I could tell you 50 names, but that's not going to work in your brain because you. <laughs> Describe yeah, movies. I don't know us. people. You don't know the names of songs. <laughs> oh, that song! By the, you know it's by one person, but you don't know what There's the title. A difference is. in knowing and caring. I don't oh, care Sean, to know. Do you remember when you would DJ and someone would come up and be like, "Do you know that song? It goes like this." Well, did you see on Google now where you can just hum and it'll give you percentages? Oh Jesus! That Christ. match up. <laughs> Fuck. Let me hear a hum. Hum a song for me. Well, on the commercial, it's I'll, I'll just give you the one from the commercial. I have no idea. Old Town Road. <laughs> I I a little bad sex. I'm I'm gonna tell you this right now. <laughs> I have listened to that song all the way through one time in my life. But isn't that crazy, though? You can just hum it, and it'll come up like 69% match for this, 20% match for this, 7% yeah. match for this. It's impressive. Like, I don't know. Impressive. Like, imagine if some chick came up to you and be like, what's that song with that guy and that girl? I don't know. Take your busted ass phone outside and hum it. <laughs> 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 Bring it back in here, and I'll try and look up the results. <sighs> You know no fucking drunk chick at the bar is going to be able to hum some sauce. Dude, we got it all the time, Frankie. So bad. Yeah, they just play that. Hum their hummers. That? She's I out there just humming legit, them. Legit, a girl walked up and said, can you play that one song with that guy and that girl? Mm-hmm. <laughs> that was it. Yeah. That was it. I'm playing it all night. And then I was like, like what? She's like, you know it. <laughs> You know the one. It's it was you know it. It's you like the know it. it's you like know it. it's like name that tune just for. <laughs> I know you know it. <laughs> that song that's on Kiss FM. Play you that play one. Next, we're about to, you play it next. We're about to leave. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't miss that. I want everyone to leave. <laughs> Let me play it right. <laughs> I don't miss that. I just uh, love when the dance floor is packed and a chick would come up and, can you play some good music that I could dance to? Right. What are all these people no. doing? My favorite is the fucking hillbilly that comes up. Yo, play International Harvester. <laughs> Bro, no. 
Duh. It's not going to happen. I got this happen. suave Betsy going right now. I got 50 people on the dance floor dancing. 100 people on the dance floor dancing. You want me to fucking just empty the dance floor out real quick? Oh, man. How do you not know a lot of people don't like the harvester? I don't so know. I used to get, like, if someone came up and wanted a song, I would kind of wait. I wouldn't play it next, but I'd wait a little bit, and then mm-hmm. I would play it. And uh, Well, because we'd build the mix in. Yeah, you can't just throw it up. Next, you got to beat match that shit. Yeah. Every time. Every time. Where's my song? Are you going to play my song? Right. Ah. <laughs> you said you were playing it there. You going to say something? I'm still waiting on my CD. I'm never going to get it. Uh. It's, he's going to just send you a Spotify playlist. <clears throat> By the time I get a CD, I won't be able to play it in anything. My car doesn't even have a fucking CD player. I know, it's crazy. Big ass TV, like these, no uh, CD player. The reviews, so like cars and shit, and they'll like go over the older cars, got fucking ashtray. Yeah. What's well, crazy is they still CD call players. them cigarette lighters. Mm-hmm. It's got a cigarette lighter here. I mean, uh, no power outlet. Use, so, right, exactly. Everyone uses them for their phone. That's a 12 volt, out, 12 volt outlet. They were originally <laughs> cigarette plugs. Knowledge. We're old boys. We I know. Fucking Talk. dinosaurs. Which did you Talking know? Talking to you and the dog, not did me. You, did you know that? Is uh, that a dinosaur? Did you know that they <laughs> uh, found out that dinosaurs actually quacked like or like made geese noises? What? They oh shit! A raptor them? wasn't a bird. They're all birds, bro. No way. No T-Rex was flying back in the day. Bert, dude, those ostriches little, those don't fly. Arms. So? They don't. I mean, and those things are closer to a T-Rex ostrich. than a fucking lizard. Yeah, what's up, what? bro? Yeah. I see you think an ostrich car? is more relatable to a T-Rex? That a lizard would be relatable to a T Rex. You guys want it, Frankie? If you want to go down a deep well tomorrow, no, we could make dinosaurs right now using chickens. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes, look this up tomorrow. This is a legit I thing. We could technically make Jurassic dinosaurs Park. I'm right not now using dinosaurs? chickens. Jurassic I'm not Park's fucking around, bro. Raptors have this, fucking feathers, bro. It could really happen. This is how far I go down on a YouTube vortex, Sean. You want to talk about your bullshit? I'm looking up turning chickens into dinosaurs. <laughs> That's how far I got. Reverse. And I believe them 100%. All right, you do it and let me know how it works Dinosaurs out. were closer you to birds make than a they video were lizards. And send it. A chicken? Yeah, you post the video of turning a chicken into a dinosaur. dinosaur DNA. I saw the ride. Well, go get it. The fuck? They you said you wanted to do this frogs. tomorrow. The DNA yeah. was frogs. Whatever, just fill in the holes. And you're good to go. <laughs> what? Perfect. You fill in the holes. You and, fill in uh, the holes and... Uh, what is he saying? You got dino DNA. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I haven't seen Jurassic Park in a hundred years. So I Put it on. Hundred years? That's how old you are. So I Jesus, feel like it. You are old as fuck. Old. Yeah. Jurassic. Park. I I legitimately haven't watched Jurassic Park in twenty years. That sucks. Missing out. No reason to watch it. Big time. It's yeah. good, dude. What? It's like Jaws. You know I've what I'm saying? It. Like you anytime it's Jurassic on, Park. you have to watch it. You know what movie? It was I, great. You know what movie I started to watch last night before I went to bed? Three Ninjas. Oh, you know it. No way. Tum-tum. I tried. Tum Tum Colton. What was the other one? 
Colt Tumson Rocky. 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 I always forget Rocky. Everybody scramble. Because watched, everybody um, liked Colt because Colt was the fucking rebel. Rocky was... Colt was Raphael. Rocky was Leonardo. Yeah. And Tum Tum was Michelangelo. For sure. Yeah. And Master Splinter was Mr. Miyagi. <laughs> Mr. Miyagi wasn't in that movie. It was a different dude. Sweet my deck. It's the other guy. Same it's the other Chinese guy. That has the. Uh, you know what I watched this morning at three thirty when I got up? The news. Beverly Hills Ninja. It's a great movie. Great movie. Rest in peace, Chris Farley. I think it was yesterday. It was twenty years Dude, since he passed. Way twenty or twenty three. Way longer than twenty years, man. I thought it was twenty three. Twenty three years ago, he passed yeah. away. Yesterday, fucking crazy. I felt old then, too. Do you feel old now, too? Well, I feel old it. watching sports. Think about it. Rob passed away in 07. Yeah. That's fucking crazy. Yeah. It's 2020. R.I.P. Riverside Rob. R.I.P. Team drink? I'll, team drink. I would, I would do a team drink to that. Do a team drink to that. I almost wish I had SoCo and Lime. I 100% don't. <laughs> I know, dude. It's it's like we drink Instant so much heartburn. of it. It literally is. My mouth just got really watery like I was going to throw up when we were just, just talking thinking about, about it. it. <laughs> SoCo and Lime and Jaeger Bombs are two things that you give me at the bar, I will throw up. Well, we For drink sure. enough Jaegermeister to keep them in business throughout the early 2000s. Oh, yeah. Right. Does anyone drink that anymore? I have, I have not no idea. Seen I still feel like if I cut my left foot, Jaeger would come out. I have not seen somebody <laughs> have a shot of Jaeger in the longest time. What about right. Jaeger? Like, I feel like every bar we went Eat to, they too. had those big dispensers. Yeah, but they never have a Jaegermeister bottle on it. It's a... <laughs> Everyone would drink it all, bro. Yeah, it's no. just a dispenser. It's a disp- no, Fireball's the fucking shot of choice now. Which, That's the new hotness. And that shit's garbage. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry. That I don't like I don't shit. Ash. I don't like Big Red Gum. I nope. don't like fucking Fireball. I don't you like know what I do really like? Shit. Cinnamon Toast Crunch, motherfucker. Yeah, mm. I mean, that's a delicious cereal. It's not a liquid you put in your mouth. If you mix rum chata, Bailey's, and oh, I guess neither Patron is big Cafe. red. That's cinnamon. Yeah, big red's nasty. If you My don't chew opinion. big red, then you'll fuck I don't yourself. Know about you guys, yeah, if you don't Which chew one? big red, then fuck you. <laughs> what are you, one of those fucking little <laughs> juicy fruit bitches? You look fruit like stripes, you're a little bro. juicy fruit. Fruit stripe fruit is stripe. the worst hey. gum ever. You put you put what? it in. Take two bite, two chews on it, and it's fucking. There's no flavor left. That's why you have to eat the whole pack at the right. same time. And once again, two chews, everything's gone. It's crazy how the know. pack it is all. It's all these great different colors, but it's all the same pretty flavor. sure everything tastes the same. Tastes the same. <laughs> for it's th- all like that tart, sweet. For like, thirty ooh, seconds, and then it was gone. Purple ones. Well, that's like these other ones, the bubble, bubble yum or whatever the fuck they are. It's the same thing. Mm. Don't bring me back to the bubble, double bubble. bubble. I'm double bubble, bubble it up. What are you showing me? Uh oh. Oh man, look at this guy. He's gonna be like, I got some double bubble right here. I must say, Jeff's got the best Christmas decor. Out of all of us. I mean, just look at it. It's so festival. Festival. Oh, that stuff's trash. Trash ass yeah. gum. <laughs> trash. Go ahead. Best gum for pop, two bites. Pop it in your mouth. Let us know how it tastes. No. That would be fucking chomping on the microphone. <laughs> trash. No one wants to listen to me anyway. Then they want to listen to me chew. Hey. We're the most self-deprecating podcast there is. That's right, what he said. Goddamn right. But you know what? I listen to it, 
I enjoy it. So fuck you if you don't. <laughs> I enjoy just talking about it. Hi, yeah, I listen to I listened to it for the last hour. I've, I've been listening to it the whole time. See, I, I would rather listen to us talk than Vin Diesel's new pop song. Oh, I don't. <laughs> oh, I concur. See, I think I don't Fra- know how you guys feel about it, Frankie. I think you should listen to the podcast so we don't keep hearing about the same. 12 topics we always bring up like the Dells or Alcohol. Bro, he's a, he's a, he's got it right though. He just does his thing and walks away. <laughs> Comedy gold. See you later. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Just I got turn the cameras on and I, got I ain't writing shit down. down turn, the, turn the cameras on and watch all- you shine. Let me get all my notes out. <laughs> Good to go. Nice. I'm here. Fuck it. All right, and you'll do it live. It's nice not having any uh, expectations. If you perfect, will. I'll never disappoint. Goes into the cosmos. Aim if low. I held myself to a high standard, I never Aim reached low. it. You know, I would be disappointed goes in myself. To outer space. That's crazy. <laughs> Our podcast goes to outer space. No way. It's just it has. It's just crazy. Really? Our, our podcast actually has the reach that it does. Like, so like alien? Like you could get it could get all the way around. <laughs> yeah. It's not stopping halfway. It goes all the way around. <laughs> Till it comes right back together. I don't know. Is that how you do it? No, it's crazy that we've, you know, had plays in fucking Brazil. In you gotta say it right, Brazil. Brazil. This is Brazil. <laughs> you know, Brazil in the UK and. 27 different parts of Russia. <laughs> you know, it, it's insane to me that we've... People have listened to us, our verbal diarrhea. Yeah, I'm just impressed anyone would want to listen to this shit. I want to condemn how well Dude, you can listen condone. to nonsense. and Condone. Yeah. Condemn condemn. means tear down. <laughs> yeah. The fact that they've torn down their standards to listen to this show for an entire hour, I give them condolences. All right? Hey. Great job. It's a coincidence. Hey, I'm... You know it. On top of the soldier's shoulder. Yeah, because yeah. if he gets shot, if the soldier got shot in the shoulder, it could be really a uh, coincidence of a thing. No. Oh, Jesus Christ. Can we, can we just end this abortion? <laughs> for tonight. No, how dare you? Damn. The play of Parenthood are going to come after us. We can't even play our theme song anymore. Yeah, right. Well, YouTube. Fuck you, YouTube. Let's be honest. Don't say that. No, I'm, I'm going to say this. Stop fucking flagging everybody for fucking shit. Stop. Yeah. Listen to what he's saying. Just stop. Stop, stop it, guys! Uh, fucking stop! Especially small, small time oh. people like us. We have yeah, no stop. fucking following. So what's the fucking point of? You can't demonetize us because we ain't fucking anywhere close to where you need to be to fucking. Go ahead and preach, demonetized. Sean. Let them know. I'm. It's stupid. You're 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 killing the you're killing the small guy. To make yourself fucking feel better. Killing the vibe. All right. We're just putting the dude, vibe out there and they're killing it. glitching out. I yes, give dude. Already trying to cut you off. They're trying Good, to shut let you em. down. Let them. I'm an, a fucking American. I own guns. <gasps> Ladies dun, and gentlemen, dun, this is coming dun, live dun, broadcast. Dun, <laughs> they're taking us down. Dun, 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 nah, it's, everybody is too fucking uptight nowadays. Everybody wants to cancel everybody. Everybody. Oh, my feelings are... Shut the fuck <laughs> up. 
<laughs> I'm being dead honest with you. Hey, Ben. John, let's honest. stand up and fucking. I'm, I'm just fucking saying. It's, Aww. it's, it's, it's ridiculous. It's gotten pussified. It's ridiculous. Do a fucking it's all push the, up. Uh, all the Facebook push shit and the social media. I don't People know what gender nasty. I am. I don't fucking care. No one else in the world cares about you. Your dog wants you to settle down. Give me a hug. Look at him. You need some meditation. Dog. Hey, buddy, do you give a shit about anybody's gender? No, you don't. The only thing you care about is piss, shit, sleep, and food. Dude, it's funny is the boys were telling me the other day that they were talking on the school bus. Now, mind you, these are 11-year-olds. And uh, they were talking about how someone was going to identify as this or that or that or talking about uh, these kids are 11. I didn't talk about any of this shit when I was 11. Dude, what are you going to identify yourself as? Right. And the one kid got uh, one of the boys is like, well, then why don't you just identify yourself as a toaster? And everyone was like, oh, shit. Damn. A toaster? (laughs) Toast? And I'm not being insensitive to your fucking situation. I get it. But when you keep fucking slamming it in our faces day after day after day after day, it gets old. It gets so fucking old. <laughs> I don't care what bathroom you use. I really don't. If you want to use the like men's room. If you some use people do. No. It shouldn't have any fucking bearing on what happens during your day. Just like the people that call the cops on fucking little kids selling bottles of water. What's the fucking point of that? Yeah. They're not paying taxes. Yeah. I got to pay taxes, Sean. Sam. No. The fuck needs to be paying taxes on their if water. You're, if you're calling the fucking cops on a lemonade stand, I think you should be drugged into the middle of the street and shot in the back of the fucking head, execution style. Whoa! Damn. Because your life has nothing going on in it that you have to shit on a little kid. Well, people are miserable. She's probably on Facebook and posted a picture of her child. And They're probably like, my child. lemonade stand okay. only got four people yesterday because of these little fucks. No, it's not even that. It's I'm just talking about there's the video of the lady walking in the fucking woods and the two girls are doing TikToks and she's fucking snapping on them. Yeah. Screaming at them. What the fuck is the Maybe point? Maybe that was a TikTok free zone. No, but what's the point of your life if you just keep fucking walking? Who gives right. a fuck? <laughs> I just watched a video today about a dirt biker going down a trail and some guy like stopped him and he's like, but he's bitching at him. He's like, there's no bikes down this trail. And uh, <laughs> he's like, you ruined my whole day. And the dude from the motorcycle just punches him right in the fucking <laughs> face. I bet his day got a whole lot worse then. And knocks him down. And he goes, what now? You all right? You having a worse day? And he starts his bike and fucking... But that's the shit I'm talking about. Real. Why stop policing? You're not a fucking police officer. Don't police the fucking public. Oh, my God, you're at Walmart and someone bumped your cart. You're going to call fucking 911? It might. Just, I don't know, man. I've heard there's cart cops well. now, right? The cart cops, aren't they out there? You don't return your carts, they get you. Put your yeah. picture on the internet. Let it's people not know that you don't put your person. carts away. It's not hard to be a good person. It really isn't. You see someone no. that needs your fucking assistance, you help them. You see little kids fucking selling lemonade. Go toss them the fucking dollar and get a cup. Who fucking cares? Stop calling the police on fucking frivolous bullshit. I feel like your guys' neighborhood's got some Dude, bad this is, people in it. See, the, the, it's the, I, don't, I don't see cops taking down lemonade Frank, you stands. haven't Where's seen me outside permits? in six months. What are you talking about? Yeah, that's what you're talking about. <laughs> Sunlight's see a lot not of your lemonade front. stands like in your one block radius. I probably would have more lemonade stands than you guys. My daughter made about twenty five bucks. Yeah, Three until hours that, worth of work. Till that bitch shut her down. 
No. Right. The cops were called. We shut it down ourselves. Yeah, I'm kidding. We seen the but, fuzz rolling. I said, all right, baby girl, time to pack this operation there up. Pack it up. Millions of videos that pop up every day of, sorry to say, mostly it's middle-aged white women. Karens. A lot of Karens. A lot of Karens. Stop feeding into it. Don't don't watch those videos anymore. I feel it, like she's bringing you, you down, man. Not she's bringing you down. It. It's well, and just it's kind of like you have to see the person's face. You know when someone's driving so slow in front of you, and like when you pass, <laughs> you have to look and see what they look like. Like who did this to me? Like who is driving that slow? Like you look to see if it's an old person. And you're like, all right, I'll cut them some slack. So and it's, it's like usually a, some young kid doing their makeup and on their face. Right. Then so, I got a problem. I can describe but it's the same thing. I can describe the person to you without even having to see a video. And they'll be like, that's exactly what the person looked like. It's either one of two things. It's either a short haircut, possibly frosted, glasses, slender woman. Or it's a frumpy ponytail woman. What's frumpy? Meaning built like me. <laughs> You're frumpy? It's a whole catalog on Pornhub. Frumpy. Frumpy. <laughs> but it's... The way I see Give it, it's, me some of that frumpy boy. It's people that hate themselves so much they have to take it out on everybody else. Yeah. And it's unfortunate. Just, you know, ELE, everyone love everyone, including yourself, all right? I tell my daughter every time, I'm like, who do you love? And she always names herself. I said, that's the most important one. That's all that matters. Yourself. Well, if you don't love yourself, then people are going to walk all over you. I've said it before, be and I'll off. say it again. It starts a strong sense of stealth, leads to a strong sense of family, leads to a strong sense of community makes the world a better fucking place. That's actually the first time I've heard you say that. And that's where we're building here at the Gentleman's Den. Yeah, do I go on Love rants you all. about fucking stupidity? Because the world is fucking full of it right now. It is insane. Oh, boy. <laughs> Taste that fucking flavor right there. Welcome to Flavor oh, Country. What is this? I'm twirling it in my goddamn hands. This gum is going to be so good. Welcome to Flavor Country. John Sackens, baby. While we're doing all this positivity and all this other shit, shout out to Guy Fury. Saving restaurants across America. Saving the bar business. The bar workers, for sure. He didn't do shit for the bar I work in, but for all the other ones that he did do, help out. Hey, he did something, right? Yeah, Better than he, well, like I said, he made a move, and I props to him, because there's... I feel like you can hear me chewing, I'm sorry. It's really loud in my head. California, <laughs> I, dude, I, my heart goes out to California. Really, it does. We always, you know, Why, you, there's always jokes, you know, oh, L.A., but, but that governor fucking killed any small business in that fucking state. Yeah, it sucks. My heart goes out to all the people that are struggling. And I just seen Arnold just Schwarzenegger did. gave up millions of his own dollars so that way he could open in poll stations in California because all of his rich friends in other countries laughed at him and said, you have to pay your own money as a citizen to vote in your country because we have no voting acts. Bro, is that your Schwarzenegger? <laughs> I feel like that was spot on, but it's what he sounded like earlier when I heard it. No, Do you... it again. Why don't you sign us off, Frankie? This is not the governor of California, Arnold Schwarzenheisen. I'm not the Terminator. I, I, I guess all I got. All right. John, I got you, you got no music. You got, I mean, <laughs> you, you want me to do it in a Schwarzenegger voice or should I do it just in the regular voice? You, you sign us off. Yeah, there you go. With Schwarzenegger. Sign us off. Everybody love everybody. Everyone try to be a good person. I love you all. Yeah. Merry Stop Christmas. chewing that Mer fucking gum and shut Merry up. Merry Christmas. Happy birthday, oh, yeah. Sean. Merry Christmas. 
festive Kwanzaa, happy Hanukkah. And, and happy birthday to Sean. He'll be one year older next week. One year older and a shitload of shit, shit more pissed off. English. It's fucking a rough fucking. We do. <laughs> we do it, it good. We speak good English <laughs> speak you now. You speak it, motherfucker. <laughs> All right, for Jeff or Frankie, I am Sean. It's been another edition of The Gentleman's Den. Thank you for listening. Don't forget to like, subscribe. Uh, Push some buttons. On uh, YouTube, hit the uh, little bell thing so you get notified every time we uh, pop up. Push the goddamn button. And don't forget to go to shop.spreadshirt.com backslash the hyphen gentleman's hyphen den. For all your Gentleman's Den merch needs. And if you go and shop right now, you get 15% off anything you buy. 15%. 15 everybody. Go check it out. 15%. I'm going to go do that right now. Only beep, 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 beep. Frankie's going to have a shirt up this week. Honestly. Go check and see. Go check and see. The Gentleman's Den. We are out. All right, boys.